So I've just checked into my next hotel, a bird. This bed is so cute, it's like a little princess bed. Got a nice little painting. I finally, so the last two hotels I stayed in, didn't have a bath, and we have a bath. Can't wait to have a bath tonight. It took, so normally it's meant to take an hour to get to Ubud, but it took four hours. I was a landslide in Ubud, um, so we're at a standstill, and I had to get out of the car and walk. Well, we were gonna walk 40 minutes, but then, Luckily we got out where the landslide was, we managed to get through it. We had to walk through the mud and then we got another taxi. Let me show you the outside. There's also a spa here. I mean, it's so dark you can't really see anything. to the rice fields today. Um, last time I came to Bali, I missed that because I didn't have time, so I'm really excited. Um, the cat came this morning. Oh, it was laying out on the balcony, sleeping here, and then I opened the curtains, it was just meowing at me, it was so cute. Um, but I fed her some breakfast, hopefully she'll come back again tomorrow, or later today. But she's so cute, she's so small. But yeah, I'm gonna go find breakfast first, and then I'm gonna head to the rice fields. So last night, this cat kept me out at the front door and she's on the balcony. Oh, This is your papa. Oh, I can't even do a piece down, but I'm at the Reese, Reese Rice Field now. Look at my hair. Look at this view. It's so nice. I thought it'd be a lot bigger here, but... Oh my god, I think I've been bitten. <gasps> no, I've been bitten. My legs are still alone. Oh, mate, there's literally so much climbing up here. I'm so out of breath. It's raining now. Um, I'm going to head back down, go on the swing, see what that is saying. And then I'm going to go to Jungle Fish. It's like a, um, a restaurant with a pool. I think it has a nice view. So I'm going to head there for lunch, have a little swim if it hopefully stops raining. What the hell is that? Oh my god, that stinks. I think it's mouldy pineapple. But it's so nice here. Wait, you can't see it. Yeah, I'm gonna head back soon. I'm so hungry. I only had a small breakfast, but it's just so beautiful here. <laughs> Mate, just out of nowhere, it's raining so much. So relaxing, just like listening to the rain. Sat here watching it. So the plan was to go to Jungle Fish. Um, mainly because there was like a pool you can chill there, there's like a viewpoint and to get lunch but because of the weather it's raining so much i'm just gonna head to a little restaurant it's gonna have some healthy foods i'm so hungry and then i'll see what the weather's like maybe go to a beach club not a beach club maybe. i don't know what they're called but it's like a, they have like a pool and the sickest view just a swim pool um but if not maybe just go to the spa in my hotel and get a massage because i've not had a massage yet so I want to get a massage, but I'll see what the weather's like. It is um, the start of rain season, so the last three days not been the best weather. Oh, I just had lunch at first and I'm so glad I didn't go to it's so loud. I'm so glad I didn't go to um jungle or oh, I can't remember what it's called now. Because the meal here was unreal. It was also healthy, the view was good, they had like these sick desserts as well. I didn't have any but it looked really good. 
Um, but I'm so, honestly, I'm so glad I ditched going to Jungle Ball because this restaurant was really good. I really want to go again. Um, I'm now going to head back to my hotel. We just chill and then go get a massage, chill at the spa. The thing is, like these little jungle trees, it reminds me of Avatar. It looks so cool. That is literally the size of my hand. Oh, it's getting milk. That's oh, it's just started raining. We've got the ice pool there, a little fire pit, swimming pool. Oh, god, it's starting to rain. I feel like the weather's so bad here, but they've got um saunas here. Oh, it's raining, but it's so nice here. The gym is unreal. Probably like my favorite gym. Cute little fireplace, the interior is so nice. Now I'm in the sauna, mate. They have two saunas here, and it's massive. Those. Wow. Look. Um, they also have another sauna, an ice bath, which I dipped my toes in and I just can't do it. I hate being cold. Um, but I said to myself, after this, I'm going to try it. This bowl, got some fresh green juice, freshly made. Um, yeah, this is lit. massive. Looks so good. This is just like protein. Mine's all there. So I'm now back at my hotel. Um, I went to the gym and it's probably the best gym I've ever been to. It's my favourite gym, they've got a spa and like outside they have, um, it's called like an art cafe. This is really cool cafe, they've got 
uh, salad bowls, fresh juices, it's all like super healthy. The gym is unreal, the spa, they have an ice bath. I don't like, but I tried it out, it's quite cool. It's just overall, it's just so good. I'm now gonna go do a little hike. I can't remember where it's called. I mean, it's been raining all evening. It's now stopped, but it's like super cloudy. So I'm gonna get my hike in before it starts raining again. It probably will start raining, but I'm gonna pack my raincoat. Yeah, I'm gonna try this hike out. Apparently it's like really nice views. Um, I don't really know how long it is, but so I was getting so excited about seeing the cat that's on my balcony. She always waits there for me. And as soon as I open the door, she's just meowing at me, wanting my attention, coming to sit on my lap. It's so cute. But yeah, I messaged the cat sentry and they're not like keen on taking her in because she's not injured or anything. Um, but I'm gonna just keep begging. I'm also gonna message a few other places because I do not want to leave her behind. Like, I don't know, like, I feel so heartbroken if I left her behind. She's just so adorable. I am ready. Apparently the views here, the trek is meant to be beautiful. I mean, it's so green here. Look how green it is. My favorite form of exercise has to be hiking. I love hiking. I think it's so peaceful, so relaxing. I love being in nature. I love sniffing nature. I love looking at it. Oh, it's just so peaceful. So I did the hike, it's about 20 minutes I think it was. I thought it'd be like an hour. But I'm walking for it now, again. But I stopped off up there um, to grab a coconut. Fresh coconut was really good. And there was loads of like little cute puppies. It was so cute. I didn't want to leave. Oh, it's so cute. If I won the lottery, I think the first thing I'd do is buy a massive house and then loads of animals, dogs, cats, fluffy chickens, runner ducks, alpaca. home to my little baby. I've been feeding that out of a um, an ashtray. <laughs> it is clean, but that's her little food bowl. I've got some little snacks. But I did um, a message at Cat Sanctuary and I'm waiting to hear back from them. I'm gonna message one tomorrow. I need to find another one. So I'm gonna message them tomorrow because I don't wanna leave behind. I keep thinking about how I, what I leave soon and I keep thinking about just how she's going to be alone no one here to feed her just look how cute she is I really want to take her home you're so cute good morning so I'm now I've literally just woken up I'm heading to Crater I think that's what the pool's called they've got like this massive infinity pool that overlooks like the rice field it looks insane um, I'm literally going with wet hair because I've literally just had a shower, I've just woken up. Haven't eaten anything yet, but my friend messaged me saying that they've got a bed there, so I'm gonna head there today. The plan was to go to the ATV bike bike thing, um, but I woke up too late, so maybe I'll do it when I'm in Uluwatu. But yeah, I'm gonna head there now.
So it's still raining, it's slightly stopped, but I've left now because I want to walk through the rice fields. It's still very, very wet. Wow. You can do like, I don't know if you can see it, like a double bike zip line. So cool. King Kong! King Kong! That's so cool. <laughs> So showing you how they make their coffee. That's poo. Oh, that's the poo. <laughs> that's poo? Yeah. You just eat it like that. Coffee poo. So they're in the red. Eternal, yeah. There's yeah. one. Apparently it's like a raccoon. Oh, it's aggressive. Oh, it's aggressive. Oh. Film that. They call this um, the poo coffee cappuccino. It's so funny. <laughs> wow. I want to try it, but I'm waiting for it to cool down. Strong, mate. That's really hot. Ugh. Got back. Um, that coffee was gross. Come here. Back to my little baby. Oh, here she is. Come sit on me. I love how she just come and sit on my lap. It's so cute. But yeah, that coffee was gross. So basically, they had this animal that eats the cocoa beans or coffee beans, and then it poos it out. And then I think they clean it, and then they make coffee out of it. That coffee is very, very strong. Oh, I'm now gonna go get a massage at my hotel. It's meant to be unreal. So, a 60 minute body massage, body scrub, body mask, and then like a flower bath. You probably see this all over Instagram the, the flower baths. It's such a barley thing. <laughs> but so, I finally contacted someone about the cat. I'm gonna take her to the vets after my massage. Um, she's gonna get a vaccine and then she's gonna stay in the vets for a week and then the cat sentry she's gonna go pick up the lady well the owner of it she's gonna come and pick her up from the vets and then take her in so i found her at home you're so cute just going to the spa so you get to smell the oils which one you want to use first and then the masks I am back from my massage and wow, my skin is so smooth. Oh, <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing that. Honestly, my skin is so smooth. The massage was unreal. Did like a body scrub, a clay. She put clay like everywhere. <laughs> and then I got into this flower bath. It was really, really nice. I absolutely loved it. I'm pretty tired now and very hungry. Um, I was gonna take the cat to the vets, but I don't wanna get a taxi on my own and be somewhere like, it's quite far from, well, it's, it's close to me, but it's a little bit far, but I think I'm gonna go tomorrow morning. I'm gonna wake up at eight and I'm gonna take her then. But for now, I'm gonna go get some dinner. Um, I need to get dressed, I need to wash my hair. It's so wet and greasy. Oh, but I've had such a good day. The pool was really nice. I'm kinda of gutted that the weather was a bit crap. But what can you do? We're in Bali race season, what can you do? But you did get a bit of sunshine in the morning. I always find that in the morning you have the best weather and then around two or three, it will rain. It will rain for an hour and then it will stop and it will just be cloudy for the rest of the day.